them for peace. Now it's time to see what has happened in the Eurovision universe and there is some pretty interesting updates. First up, today the artist for Mellow Festival was announced and among the participants we now know that Mons Selmerlöv is back. You probably know him as he won Eurovision in 2015 with the song Heroes and today he announced that he is going to participate again with a song called Revolution. Heroes Revolution seems like it is in the same ballpark, but he says that he actually likes Revolution better than he likes Heroes, so that is promising news. It was also an artist called Ella Tirittiello who was going to participate with the song Bara du är där, that is actually written by Lorem. So that is also quite an interesting news. There is also this guy Gresula or Grek. Zula, I have it, I have no idea how to pronounce that with believe me and he was said to be prince inspired that is also quite promising and he looked like a million bucks today another fun participant that was announced was Mayra Mayra you maybe know from love is blind Sweden so that is quite interesting she is participating with the song hush hush so uh, let's see of the 30 participants that were announced today 14 has already participated. Annika, Arvingana, Garlet is back from last year. Baby Lasagna just got married to his Elisabetta. Congratulations. Novartis is now the new official partner of Eurovision 2025. That is a pharmaceutical company from Basel. So you know that. Bashar Murad, the one that came in second in Songwa Kepnin in Iceland last year, has uh, said on his TikTok that he has submitted songs for Iceland, Ireland and San Marino 2025. Good luck to you, Bashar. Theo Evan is the official first artist that has been announced for Eurovision 2025 from Cyprus. He is now recording his song, so it's going to be interesting to see what they bring to the table this year. Israel might be on their way out of Eurovision. There has been a law that has just gone through where the government is considering to make the national channel, broadcasting channel, Khan private. And so now the law is through and that may be lead to, if implemented, that Israel will not participate in Eurovision 2026. Georgia won Junior Eurovision Song Contest. Congratulations, Andrea. You did great. And if you haven't seen it, you definitely should. It was a great performance and a well-deserved win, I think. Eurovision was in danger for some time, but in the end, the citizens of Basel approved the financing of Eurovision 2025 with over 60% of its participants supporting the show. And uh, so now we don't need to worry about if the show is going to be great or just a little sad. The new national final in Greece is going to be hosted by the Eurovision legend Sakis Ruvas. Yeah, what a legend. Uh, so happy for it. Can't wait to see him again. I have been miss I have missed him a lot. Just Klein released a statement for his decision not to participate in Eurovision 2025. In essence, it says, uh, my team and I had everything ready, but it just doesn't feel good. I need to give myself more time to heal. I have to follow the light, not fight against it. I am not made for this machine. He felt like he accomplished what he was hoping to accomplish in Eurovision. So I'm happy for him and I hope he feels better soon. And good luck following the light from now on. Just Before we go to the national finals update, there has been some rumors. Juju Siva rumors of representing Poland for Eurovision 2025 was fake. We all know that now. But uh, Tommy Cash rumors of him participating in Estilao is now confirmed. His song Espresso Macchiato, written by Thomas and Johannes Naukarinen, who is the songwriter behind Karia's Cha Cha Cha, will be released on December 6th, so you should definitely keep an eye out for that. I cannot wait to listen to 
espresso macchiato. And if you don't know who Tommy Cash is, uh, I will put a link in the description so you can get to know him a little bit better. So to a little national final update. We now have 38 countries that have expressed their interest to participate in Eurovision 2025. We're so happy about that. One more country from last year that is going in the right direction. But there has now been a lot of announcements uh, as the national final season is right around the corner. So the artists from the national finals in Albania, Montenegro, Estonia, Spain, Belgium, Luxembourg, Latvia and Sweden is now announced. The competing songs from Montenegro are released and some of the snippets from Latvia and Supernova is released on Instagram and uh, four of the 20 acts has released their songs in full from Supernova as well so one can check that out. I will also give a link in the description to some of the songs that has been published already. So what is to come? The 27th of November tomorrow is the Montesong 2024 final going ahead in Montenegro from 8 till 11 o'clock. They are set up for a strong comeback this year and if you haven't seen the competing artists yet then you can watch all of them here. I'll put a link down in the description. I am crossing my fingers for Bodiak. Who are you crossing your fingers for this year? 1st of December, the artist for Sanremo in Italy will be announced. The 4th of December, the songs for Supernova will be released. The 6th of December, songs for Estilao will be released. The 12th of December, artists for Malta's national final will be announced. And the 18th of December, songs for Benidorm will be released. Between the 19th and the 22nd of December, Albania will hold their national selection Festivali uh, Kengis, uh, with the final being held the 22nd of December. I hope you all are ready for this season of national finals. I cannot wait. If you wondered where I got where I get all my news, you should definitely check out ESC News. That is the place to be get informed first. So absolutely check them out. You can follow them on Instagram. Also, if you are not very familiar with the national finals, you can check out our ranking where you can get really deep into why, like the feel of the different national finals and who you should follow this year. So I will put a link to that in the description below. As well as if you didn't see the national finals of 2024, no worries, we made a video so you can get all the gems that you missed. I will also put that in the description. And when that is said, I hope you will enjoy the Montesong final. I'm so happy you're back Montenegro. And I hope you have a nice night. And remember to like and subscribe if you appreciate our content. And uh, see you very soon. Bye! Mwah! Wow.